So as you guys know, we have recently uh, partnered with a lot of uh, uh, other designers, other influencers who, who have been releasing named products. Uh, Potato Jet, G Nagata, to name one of them. Caleb Pike with the VB212, uh, which actually won NAB Product of the Year Award. Uh, Brandon Lee's also one of our, 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 our favorite creators that we have been working with. They're all our favorite creators. That's why he's one of our favorite creators. But uh, recently, uh, last year, we released the uh, Brandon Lee uh, iPhone 15 Pro Max cage. Huge popular item, had a beautiful green uh, color scheme to it, uh, and had a lot of great little uh, uh, extra function, uh, functional uh, accessories that were added to the kit. Now, uh, a lot of individuals have not just really been creating only with the iPhone. A lot of individuals have been using like the newer updated modern uh, uh, Samsung uh, phones, Xperia phones. I myself am a former Xperia phone user and I love it and an LG phone. Uh, and so uh, the Android platform and the iPhone platform, they aren't always exactly compatible, but to kind of help bridge that, we have worked once again with Brandon Lee to bring you this brand new all-in-one uh, universal phone cage. So the new phone cages that we have been introducing with our new generation of phones, as you can see here, I'm gonna go ahead and re remove this from, as you can see, I've removed it from the tripod all in one click. But what about our handles as well? We have been using this quick release system that we have implemented into our new ecosystem to, uh, for use on our, on our phones. Uh, we also do still have quarter 20s on here. We do have cold shoe mounts on here, but instead of having two on the regular iPhone uh, 15 Pro Max phone cage, we've actually added a total of four on here. And as you can see, we do also have a modular uh, mounting solution for your lenses. The lenses are magnetically stackable on a magnetic ring. This ring also does cover multiple lenses. So like I was saying earlier, if you wanted to use this on, on, on like a Galaxy or on a, on a Google uh, or any kind of other Android device, you are no longer just limited to the iPhone uh, platform or ecosystem itself, but you can now use this on almost every uh, iPhone system. So this right here is, a, is an electronic rocker. So if you wanted, you kind of use like a digital zoom on your phone. So you're not like, you know, whenever you use your phone, you, 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 you do the, 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 yeah. So now you actually have your, your, your one rocker up here. And then you also have a start and stop trigger. You have a removable system. So you still have that. You do still have uh, a USB-C chargeable right here. So if you wanted to, you could just keep this in your pocket, kind of click. So you hold it for three seconds. It starts to blink. And then once it starts to blink, you're ready to connect. So uh, a, lo a lot of the other things that we have also kind of added uh, as far as uh, uh, functionality, flexibility to our, our builds is you can add a uh, you can add an external battery pack to it. We do have clamp systems and mount systems that you can add. For example, uh, right here in my hand, I actually have a Samsung uh, SSD module that we have uh, co-collaborated with them. As you can see, it's got like a clip system on it and on the clip system, you know, it's your typical clip system, but the clip system is also wide enough to actually fit inside of a hot shoe. Just nice and snug, if that makes sense. And then from there, you can just run this into, uh, into your device. So if you're run most likely, you'd probably be running a hub system and then you would just be able to connect it directly to it. Yeah, and then there you go. And if you wanted to mount this anywhere else, you can. You can, as long as you got a cold shoe mount, absolutely. So the new iPhone 15 Pro Max does utilize the USB-C port, uh, most modern uh, Android phones as well. And so what we have done is we have uh, collaborated with uh, with uh, Samsung to make a, 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 a very compact, portable SSD device uh, dedicated for use for mobile uh, photography, videography. Uh, and then if you ever, ever want to use, like let's say for example, you want to go the full, full build, you want to have yourself audio, you want to have yourself the, the memory, you want to have yourself external power. Uh, what else is the other one? Uh, I know that there's usually like three or four ports that you might want to put in here. You could use something like a, like a, like a Belkin hub is what I've seen that's actually a lot more uh, feasible or I should say a lot more compatible. There are multiple hub systems out there but you gotta do you gotta do your due diligence and check to see which hub is it works best. Cause uh, I had a I had a customer as of just recently. Uh, we went for like a whole month straight just trying to find him a hub because he was kind of going for the cheaper, inexpensive option. He was going for a lot of uh, you know Amazon select products, but those were more like hubs for computers. They weren't necessarily designed for in and out uh, data transfer on a mobile phone. Belk, as of right now, uh, what we actually have on display in B&H is a Belkin hub, 
which actually works. But uh, stay on the lookout because we also might be looking to produce a hub here of ourselves pretty soon. Can't say yes, and I can't say no, and I can't say we should, if that makes sense. <laughs>